this is how I solder my surface mount uh, boards I've um, got some solder paste here and we've got 10 components, there's two capacitors there and uh, the two ICs two caps, two MOSFETs, two resistors, so it's 10 components uh, that's 30 solder pads on here and uh, there's a soldering iron that's a big old heat gun so let's start applying the solder paste alright now getting the correct amount of solder paste is quite tricky you don't want to get too much you don't want too little so just want a nice little thin amount on each solder pad and you definitely don't want to bridge the two ICs or the pins on the two ICs so I'll just speed through this bit of the video Oh, that looks about right, a very thin amount of solder paste across the pads on the board and now we shall start mounting the components Now that's all the components in place and now for the hot air and actually solder these into place That's it, they're all soldered into place. Just let that cool and we'll have a look at it. And there it is, all done. There's a camera of focus on it. Yep, all uh, good joints. Managed to burn the uh, cardboard a little bit, but that always happens. <laughs> So, um, yeah, that's, uh, I noticed on the video, um, it was a bit sort of slow because I had the camera above it, so yeah, the heat sort of had to come in from one way, but usually when I do it and get the heat directly above, um, the whole thing uh, sort of all solders at once, uh, a bit quicker than it did on this video, but, so the camera's in the way, I had to come in at an angle uh, with the heat, so that's how I solder my, uh, surface mount devices. Here's one um, where I did apply a little bit too much solder paste and it's bridged two um, connections there on the one of the ICs. So how you can fix this is um, you can use some liquid flux, this is uh, just liquid flux, no clean flux, or what I'm going to use here is a flux pen um, and uh, the way I fix these bridges, if you ever get them, is take your flux pen um, or your liquid flux, cover that with flux, and take a clean soldering iron um, with you know, brush off all the solder that's on it, and basically you can just run 
your soldering iron across this way or pull it this way you usually find that running it across that way does the trick there you go and uh, okay it's covered in flux now but I'll just go and clean the board and uh, have a look at it right I just cleaned the board off, cleaned all the flux off with methylated spirit um, and you can now see that that connection is fine um, just if you do do that you just got to be careful not to heat it up for too long you just want to sort of brush the iron across that way or pull it that way um, make sure there's no solder on the iron and should do the trick and uh, flux is the key so there you go